Hi everyone, this is Jasper here and in today's video, I will be sharing with you the latest digital bank in Singapore, which is Trust Bank. Now, a digital bank is unlike the traditional banks that we are so used to seeing. A digital bank does not have any physical branch and it starts off fully online. And Trust Bank, although it's a new name, but is backed by two of the very well-known companies in Singapore, and that is Standard Chartered and Fair Price Group. This video is not sponsored, but if you would like to create an account, do use my referral code below so that you and I will both get $10 fair price vouchers. So the main reason why I signed up for this card is really because of the partnership with Fair Price. So if you have watched my previous video where I share about our expenses as a family of four, you will see that we are spending about $1,800 every month on groceries. And a very big portion of that is at Fair Price. So the current OCBC and NT you see plus card will cease as of 1st February 2023. So I feel that if you are already a regular shopper at fair price and you have already been using the OCBC and NTC plus card, then signing up for this trust bank digital credit card is really a no-brainer. So if you are already in this situation and you are already an NTC member, then signing up for the credit card with Trust Bank is the best way to get the maximum savings when you shop at fair price. So this will allow you to enjoy up to 21% savings as long as you spend outside of fair price of more than $350. However, do take note that this 21% is just a promotional rate and it may be revised down to 14% at the end of the year. So some of you may be wondering, how do you clock in a minimum of $350 every month outside of Fair Price Group? And let's take a look at some of the merchants that they do have a partnership with. So as you can see here, these are some of the merchants that both you and I probably spend a good amount of money on, you know, every month. And these include like Caltex, you know, Starbucks, Gojek, you know, Burger King, Food Panda, and so on. So I think that in order to achieve that 21% savings and having to spend $350 every month outside of Fair Price Group is quite achievable, especially if you drive and then if you go to Caltex, that's probably close to $300 to $400 every month already. So the one thing that I really like about this card is that it allows you to choose the repayment date for your credit card bills. So for example, if your salary comes in on the very last day of the month, you can choose the repayment date to be on the first or second of the next month. It also allows you to track the rewards that you will be getting based on your current spending. So I think all these little features really makes it very user-friendly and with the bonus tracker, it really helps consumers you know to make sure that they get the rewards that they deserve so just to quickly share my experience so far i felt that the whole process was super seamless you know download the app enter the referral code and getting started you know you have to use my info with a uh, sync pass and the whole process took less than five minutes to start and afterwards you know I, I went to use it at the fair price but there was a minor glitch if you are a frequent shopper at fair price you will know that when you check out you have to tap your member card first and then subsequently the payment but there was some error when i was tapping the membership card because the card was tagged to my phone which i'm using apple pay and i couldn't do the first tap to get the link points and the staff was not really familiar with this you know probably because this is still something new and i do think this could be a glitch somewhere and i think that it will be sorted out pretty soon so when i was looking through the website it states that i'll be earning link points when i pay using apple pay Google Pay and Samsung Pay. So the one thing that confuses me a bit was that in the past, we'll be using the OCBC NTUC Plus card to tap for the membership and subsequently tap again for the payment. However, it seems like for this case, you only need to tap once and probably they will somehow be able to credit you with the link points afterwards. Now, if you are not a frequent shopper at fair price and you did not previously have the OCBC NTUC Plus card, then you might also want to consider Trust Bank for its savings account. However, do take note at the current moment, if you sign up for the savings account, you will not be able to sign up for the credit card as well. So in Singapore, we have SDIC, which insures up to $75,000 of deposits. So you can be assured that your money is safe. Now, the savings account that Trust Bank offers looks pretty good because for the first $50,000, you'll be getting 1.4% per annum interest rate. And on top of that, you'll also be having a debit card, which you can enjoy 
enjoy 11% off savings. So unlike the other banks that most of us are familiar with, Trust Bank does not have any fees when it comes to monthly maintenance fee, minimum balance, account closure, foreign transaction fee, and card replacement fee. So if you have just started working and you want to start an account to start saving money, I think this is a really good account to start with because there's no minimum balance and you're earning 1.4% per annum on your savings. And on top of that, with a debit card, you're also enjoying savings on the spending that you will be making. So I do believe that down the road, you know, people who have started with a savings account right now should be able to start a credit account in future as well. However, this detail is not finalized yet and we don't really know when will that happen. Now that Trust Bank is a newly launched platform, I think they are really giving out really good benefits and it really encourages people to sign up. So if you create an account using a referral code, you will get $10 fair price voucher. And after you make your first card spend, you will get $25 fair price voucher. And that's a total of $35. And the good thing about this is that the whole process is very seamless and it can be set up in five minutes. If you're planning to start an account, do remember to use my referral code below so that both you and I will get $10 fair price voucher each. And do let me know if you'll be signing up for this account and what are your thoughts. If you enjoyed today's video, do remember to hit the thumbs up button below. And if you're new here, do consider subscribing and turning on the notification bell so that you will be notified when Whenever I post a new video on personal finance.